हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू बॉटनी इनसाइडर सो एज आई हैव मेड अ पोस्ट ऑन द कम्युनिटी टैप दैट व्हाट आर द वेरियस डिफिकल्ट एंड आई एम ट्राइंग टू आंसर ऑल दोज क्वेश्चंस सो वन ऑफ द कॉमन क्वेश्चन दैट आई रिसीव्ड वाज दैट नॉट एबल टू हैंडल द पीजी एंड द नेट प्रिपरेशन एट द सेम टाइम दिस इज अ क्वेश्चन दैट इज वेरी वेरी कॉमन विच दिस इज अ इशू दैट मेनी ऑफ आस फेस reason being i also qualified my net examination in the third semester itself so i also had to manage and same problem was there that how to manage the time the things that i did was i made sure that i have a very good tight schedule for myself reason being if you want to have a good output for something you need to put in extra effort and for that matter you have to have a good planning in your mind that is plan out your days in the best manner possible have the time of your net examination and have the time for your pg studies as well one thing you have to remember is that pg and your net exam is not very far apart you have to study some of the points in both of them so try to correlate try to have a correlation between the two that which are the points which are the topics that are covered in both the csir and in the net examination and then try to study for example let's say you are preparing for your genetics unit for your pg examination we are considering for the pg examination if you know the syllabus of csir you know we have a unit of genetics in the csir as well now what you can do is match the syllabus of the csir of genetics with your pg exam and then try to complete the same points all together do not go for different studies for the csir different and then for the pg try to make a schedule in such a manner that you complete the similar topic of both of these things in the one place itself that is for the genetics part same goes for the for the plant physiology as well and for other units as well depending upon in which university you are and which is the syllabus that you all are following regardless of any university and regardless of from where you are doing your pg many topics would be common reason being in net examination we have a lot of questions we have a lot of topics from our pg studies itself so if you have a proper planning and if you have a good motivation for the same that yes i have to qualify this examination in my masters itself and if you make a mind that yes i have to do it for sure you will be able to do it then no excuses would be there that you didn't had time you didn't had the actual material something that would be helpful is your hard work that is summed up with your smart work smart work is very very important and how you can do is by having a strategy by having a proper planning i repeat these points in many of my videos reason being for any competitive exam take my words planning and strategy are very very important if you have a proper planning you can qualify any examination any of the paper that you are preparing for and if you do not have planning take my words you won't be able to qualify have a proper strategic planning that i have to do these points in these areas and you have a track of your preparation you can easily qualify so having the point that was that how to manage time both for the pg and the net all you have to do is make a correlation have a proper planning and then have a smart study for the same i hope this video was helpful for you i have tried to make the point as simple as for you all if you like this video do let me know in the comment sections below and also thank you so much everyone for watching this video do not forget to like share and subscribe to botany insider i'll see you very soon with more videos and more helpful content for you all and your preparation So thank you so much everyone for watching and I'll see you soon bye